I'm back. Uh, okay, back, back, back. Um, so, I think that um, it's not, it's got a lot more complicated since the last time I used Neskarov, so I'm probably not quite ready for it yet, actually. Um, so, I'm going to have to think of something else to do. Now, my lack of diamonds is killing me slowly, but I do need other stuff. Um, now, how am I doing here? You've got tons in there. Let's take these bloody planks out and put them away. Um, so, a couple of things. I could go to the nether, or I could make a boat and go to some of these nearby islands and see if I can find anything. Um, because I could. My original plan was to make the bloody. Um, you know, to make a. Uh, oh, what's it called? T to make a, a pass so I could fly around the place. But I don't think that's going to be the best bet anymore. Um, so I think I'm going to take some food and my tools and um, I'll hop on a boat and go elsewhere. I'm going to have a, a, a look around. There's, some island, there's an island over here. I need to go find rubber. Um, that's one thing I need so that I can start on some of the plastic stuff. Um, and I could do with some ink as well, let's just come to think of it. Is there a way to make to make ink? Let's just make sure I'm not... Um, so you can't make it with orange dye. Okay, so I could make it, I could make it with... Um, with that, but uh, what's a philosopher's stone in the latest version as it goes? Philosopher's stone. Okay, it's not going to tell me how to. Oh, it is. Um. So no, it's going to tell me what I can make with a philosopher's stone. It's not going to actually tell me what it is. Um. Uh, it's interesting that. Can I make uh, obsidian out of? Oh, bloody hell. Um, okay. Alright, it's no worries. Alright, so let's, um, uh, trusty uh, alchemy stone, let's, um, minium stone, let's, uh, make a wee boat here. Off we go. Let's go have a, a look around. Um, because frankly, um, yeah, see, the idea was to create an age that maybe had rubber trees in it, but I think that you need to go and explore the world. Uh, you used to go to random ages and, and find symbols, but now it looks like you have to explore the world a little bit. Mm. Now, there is a way you can um, change it so you can teleport within the same age. Uh, there's poo all on that. Alright, let's keep going this way. Um, as we've started in this direction. Uh, but, um... Yeah, it's a tough one, really. It's a bit of a toughie. Um, okay, so there is absolutely nothing in this direction. Is there? Mercy, mercy me. Hmm. No, oh, I keep. It doesn't help that I'm going around in a circle, does it? Alright, so what do we got over here? Oh, yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. So, land hoy, a little bit of it anyway. Oh, a little bit more of it, this is looking promising. Maybe I do actually have some fucking land over here. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Now, I've got no idea what rubber trees look like in this Tekka incarnation, so I'll have to probably have a quick Google of it. Um. Are going to have some more land? Is this, is, this a, is this a beach? Or are we just continuing along this horrible expanse of ocean? I'm really bummed out with this. I mean, I like my island, but there's certain things I need. And this isn't giving me. I'm going to have to go have a diamond search as well. Because maybe then I could get a quarry up. Use some of my Billcroft power. That might be quite a good thing to do. Because um, at least that way I can... What the hell is that? Oh, oil. Okay, well, that's something to know. That's quite a big oil piece, actually. That's quite nice. I don't know what the hell that is. Why is there light down there? Trying to cool. Got another island. We've got to keep a lookout for things like cactus. Because I currently don't have any. Um, but if we can get some of that, this will be a successful trip. Another oil plume. So there's quite a lot of oil over here. Go and build a refinery. That might be quite kind of cool. But I'll need to see the thing is before I can start doing this kind of cool building things, I'm going to need a lot more resource. Um, 
red flowers, I can turn those into cactus green. But actually, oh, is there a way? Uh, there might be a way I can make obsidian, so that might be irrelevant. So we've got a little chain of islands here at worst. Um, anything useful here that I can see? Uh, so pumpkins, melons, that kind of thing I'm on the lookout for. And rubber is the main, my main quest. Um, definitely need some rubber, otherwise this is a complete and utter wished of time. Um, especially as I've got all my new spanking new engines and I'm producing a nice amount of power and things like that, so keep going this way. Um, until we find something. We will find something. Yeah, it would be good if I could make a, a, some kind of teleporter with back here. So this is an island over here, but I don't know. It's not a useful island, is it? No, it doesn't frickin' look like it. Um, so keep going. We will keep going, yeah. So this is only the, the, re the original reason I, for those of you watching on YouTube, that I. Uh, I'm on this bloody island in the first place, because when I originally made this world, um, it's bloody thing, I hadn't put in something to spawn the thermal expansion wars, so um, I had to go then move to a new chunk so that they'd appear, uh, which they then did, but uh, I, I've been stuck in this ocean since then, and I've not really, I've managed to make do so far, but I've not made. I, I'm going to hit a, a dead wall, um, and I don't want to go down to the shaft yet and look for diamonds. I will do that soon. I quite fancy some mining in a bit once I get back from this trip. But yeah, it's something to sort of grinds my gears at the moment is that I've got this freaking massive desert. But we'll find it. It's all good and the hood. So I mean, this doesn't look like it's turning into land anytime soon, does it? My draw distance doesn't seem very high. I usually have it when I'm not recording, I have it, well, streaming, I have it very high, but I wonder if it'd actually be worth me turning it up for now. Look at that, I'm still sailing. Um, so how do I do that? Oh, let's change this back to recipe mode as well. Um, controls? No, no. What am I, what am I trying to do here? Uh, item IDs, global options, I don't want... I want these ones, don't I? Options. Touch screen mode, cool. Um, video settings, render distance four. Oh, okay. Never mind them. They already were. Okay, let's get going again. Um, full speed ahead. Um, so we've got another island here. What looks to be a kind of island, but actually is not going to surface because that would just be too much to ask. Um, let's keep going a wee bit. We will keep going a wee bit of oh, time. So, how long am I going to do this for if I don't find anywhere? Probably. Uh, I, I gotta kind of go for ten minutes, don't I? And then it'll be ten minutes back. What a bullet. Mm. Oh, there's the smallest island ever. Land hoy. <laughs> ah, douche. So, I mean, I've been on a lot of planes recently. Um, managed to get catch up on films, watch a cute fuck couple of good ones. Um, really liked. Uh, not a big fan of Tom Cruise because he's a bit of a, uh, you know, a, you know, a nut. But uh, I don't mind him as an actor because ever since he did the latest um, uh, Mission Impossible, I thought he was really good in that. Um, and I think that I watched two of his films on the flights. So I watched uh, Oblivion, which I actually thought was uh, pretty decent. Um, and I'm sure it's based on a book, but I haven't read it. Um, and then the other one, which I know is based on a book, which I'm going to read, um, is Jack Reacher. Now, I've heard that in the book, the character Jack Reacher is like six foot eight, which obviously is Tom Tom Cruise is, is, is probably the shortest man in Hollywood. But because uh, he's like five four, he's the same height as my mum, who's not high. Um, uh, not tall either. Arf, arf. Um, so yeah, it'll be interesting. Uh, but but I, I thought he was really good in it. He can play the hard nut quite well, which Jack Reacher kind of is. What the hell is that little structure? I don't know. I think it's just mud, isn't it? Um, 
So that was pretty good. Yeah, Oblivion was really good. I don't want to lead too much into it because there are spoilers and plenty if if if, if I do. Uh, so what else did I watch? I um. I finally watched the new Star Trek, which is pretty good. I like Benjamin Cumberbatch. I think I may have even met him once or twice, because I have a few actor friends when I was younger, anyway. Um, back before then, any of them were famous, anyway. Um, and then, um, yeah, so that was pretty good. Um, I don't think it was quite as good as the first one, which I'd like to re-watch, actually, because I can't really remember what happened. I'm not a big Star Trek fan. Uh, I'm not I'm not against it, anyway. It's, you know, fun sci-fi to me, but... Um, Never, I don't know a huge amount about it to be honest. Um, so that was pretty good. What else did I watch? I watched. Um, I must have watched more films. I watched Monsters University, which was hilarious. Um, Pixar always deliver. Uh, actually, saying that, I'll tell you what. My I, while I really did enjoy Up, I thought it's actually the weakest comedically of all the Pixar films. Um, but leading on from Pixar, I did go to Disneyland while I was in California. A couple of really cool white rides. They've done, they have a, they've redone Star Tours, which was their original Star Wars ride. And they had this before Disney bought their rights to Star Wars. Um, but what they've done with it is uh, very, very cool. Um, it's kind of like a 3D simulator. What do we got over here? It's a 3D simulator. Um, it's actually pretty cool. Uh, what what more can I say about it really it, other than that it's quite cool um, oh you bloody little squid um, so we found an island um, that's annoying what kind of tree do we think this is I don't think it's a rubber tree somehow do you I think I saw a creeper on here so we just got to be a bit careful not a bad little island as it goes let's kill this bad boy here Um, let's have a look here. What? It's not like a. That's not a rubber tree, is it? I mean, I don't know really what it looks like even. So that's what rubber leaves look like. Okay. So it looks jungly. Um, so I might actually cut down this tree. Oh, I forgot that we have the cut down the whole tree thing. Swamp land. So I gotta find a swamp. Good gosh. Thanks, Tribal. Um, so I'll take them with me because I'm now going to need to make a new boat. Oh. Let's do that now. I don't need that extra plank. Look at that bloody squid came out of nowhere and he popped me right in the kisser. Um, oh well. We'll continue on our voyage because we need to find it. It's kind of like it's. it's uh, and if I can find that bloody emerald, I can find rubber for fuck's sake. Um. So we'll keep going. Hey, what the fuck was the other thing I watched? I watched a few other things. Oh, yeah, Disneyland. Yeah, so anyway, the Star Tours thing, it's kind of, they've redone it. It's really modern, so 3D, plus simulator technology. They've done it really well. And, like, you start off in a, in a sort of starship, and, and Darth Vader kind of grabs you with the force, and they really get... I don't know how they do it with the simulator. They must be moving you around pretty damn quickly. Um, but uh, really cool. Highly recommend, especially if you like Star Wars, which I do. Um, what else did I go on? Yeah, they have the Tower of Terror, which is a good fun ride, and, the, and California Screaming, which is not really a typical Disney ride, because most Disney rides are really themed, and I think California Screaming was built when Eisner was in charge of Disney, and he was kind of letting it go a little bit. Because the really cool thing about Disney rides is the theming on them is ridiculous. Like, the queue is actually quite fun to go on quite a lot. Um, you know, they may not have the best thrill rides, but the experience is pretty damn good. And I've been to a lot of theme parks around the world, so... I feel I know. I even as an uh, amateur coaster buff, I you know I kind of know a little bit about theme parks at worst. Hmm. So what else did I get up to? Yeah, then I was working the rest of the time. Before that, I was on holiday, and basically every day I would this bar on the beach that I'm going to sit on that had Wi-Fi with my iPad and uh, play XCOM. I was basically playing XCOM on my iPad the whole time in the sun, sunbathing, and then go for a, do a couple of laps up and down. Um, another bay, I drove the boat around a little bit, just a little speedboat, it's quite good because I have a speedboat license so I get to rent a little bit more powerful one than um, most most tourists, um, I say it's not like I'm renting a powerboat, it's only 60 horsepower but it's it's quite fast when you've got no one else in it um, so there is nothing on the horizon right now, zilch zilcho zero should I let some of this render in behind around me See if that will give me any joy. I mean, like, I am feeling really unlucky here. Oh, what the hell did I just do? 
That's not a bad little feature. So, I mean, worst case scenario, if I can find some bloody cactus or something. I, I know how I can make cactus green, so it's not the end of the world. That Oh, there's a piece of land. Uh, another island, of course. Oh, but this is quite a big chain of islands. Is that a skeleton? Look at Skeleton Island over there. LA. Uh, let's go have a look at this slightly bigger one. This is a cool little feature on this map I've not seen before. Just press X on the the mini map that um, grows like that. So that's kind of cool. Oh, Creeper Island and Skeleton Island. There's a lot of sugarcane cultivating there. Oh my god, that really is Creeper Island. Look at that. Tons of them. Alright, what do we got over here? And the Sugarcane Island. Let's just make sure there's not anything too useful on any of these. So I've got, I've got sugar cane, so I don't really need to pick that up. Oh dear. All right, no joy. All right, so let's go. Let's keep, let's keep it, keep it going. So I should be able to spot things on the, this map a little bit quicker than on the other map. So let's uh, just see there's more oil over there. Um, how am I doing hunger-wise? Fine. I guess uh, driving a boat apparently is not taxing. Oh, what we got over here is that small island. Mm. It doesn't look like it's just some shallow water. I'd be aware of squids uh, attacking me from the depths again and breaking my boat. Because uh, that'd be shit if I got caught here. Because I would literally have to then swim to an island somewhere to build a new boat, I think. Because I don't think you can do it while you're floating in water. Um, so, yeah. Uh, so, this looks like a little island over here. Go check it out. Doubt it's going to have anything we need on it, but what ifs, whatever. Say what? Um, oh no, don't crash into it. Nah, okay, that's cool. But there is another island over here which has more sugar cane, which we don't need. Okay, let's keep it going. Oh god, this is infuriating. Come on. Come on, island, come on. Come on, islands, come on. Come on, islands, come on! Oh, come on, you fuckers. There must be uh, something wrong with my world again. <laughs> it's failed to spawn any land this way. Drabble, you got any ideas as to what I should, uh. What I should, uh. Which dish? Should I, maybe I've chosen the wrong direction again. Maybe that's what it is. Oh, oh, is this an archipelago or is it going to be proper land? It's just an island again. There's a couple of them. Oh, God, I thought that was like a fortress in the sky, but actually, no, of course it's not. At least that would be something different other than a bloody endless ocean. Now, how crap would it be to be like lost at sea? Honestly. Then again, I guess you wouldn't be able to, uh, <laughs> as cool as it would be, um, you're not kind of able to, um, you know, build, t you know, tech up. Although I would try, I'd Swiss Family Robinson the hell out of it. That's a big island over here. Might be something useful on here. That's quite a big island, yeah. Land, hoy! Anything useful going to be on there? Anything, anything at all? Hello, 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 hello. Two islands. Similar size to my home. The journey back home might be done with a teleport, frankly. <laughs> oh no, you bugger! Oh god, I hate boats. Oh, whoops. Um, no, why do I keep doing that? I want to go like that. Oh, another frickin' boat to make. Boat number three. Hello, Missy. Which I failed to put in the water. Okay, let's go slowly here. Okay, nothing around here. There's a fairly big island over here. Oh, how did I do that? Oh, hello, this is a big island. Not land, but at least it's a big island. <laughs> oh, watch out. Beware of floating blocks, the sailors say. Arr. Um, There don't appear to be any trees of any kind on there. I suspect I'm going to have to go to a swamp biome. Which means I need to find land. Now the problem is, is that I know one direction where there is land, but it's back in the chunk that 
that didn't have the too many items. I uh, sorry the.